again, a lot of Royals up there near the top. Uh, just your fans and kind of what they've meant and how they've kind of, they've really rallied around this All-Star stuff. Well, they, they do. And, you know, our guys are, you know, the guys especially that are leading the vote are, are you know, really guys that deserve to be leading the vote, in my opinion. Um, you know, Haas is having a great year. Uh, Salvi is, you know, having a great year. And, uh, you know, both of those guys have, are leading in their categories. We've got Lorenzo Cain, who's, uh, you know, leading or the top three of outfielders. He's having a phenomenal year, so it's all well, uh, you know, well warranted. You know, last year, all those votes, and a lot of people around the league were like, I can't believe all this ballot stuffing or whatever. And one of the guys who didn't get to make it was Osmond. He, he's, uh, he had a really solid year last year. He's really come out this first half and been, been everything you'd expect, hasn't he? Absolutely. He's had a tremendous year. Um, you know, he's been a re really key to our ball club here. Uh, you know, what he's been able to do the last couple of weeks has been amazing. He's just gotten hot. And we've been riding him for the last the last couple of weeks. But, you know, we were lucky enough, and we talked about this when we were going, you know, a little bit slow, that, it, you know, all it takes is a couple of guys to get hot. You put off a nice winning streak, and then all of a sudden Paulo gets hot, Witt gets hot, uh, Kane gets hot, uh, Haas gets hot. Here we go.